All right, good morning, everybody. Good morning. Anna, please, my presentation hall, I can hear me from here. Please just reduce the, the volume there. All right, good morning. Can everybody hear me? If you can hear me and you can see me, say yes in the chat session. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Okay, you're all welcome to today's beautiful cell meeting. Um, this is the training I wanted to do on Monday, but um, when my leader, Ambassador Ronke Koshimani, said she wanted to train us on, um, on, on, on loyalty, of course, I had no choice but to allow, you know, to um, accept that, okay? So um, this is the training I wanted to do on Monday. After our, our summit, for those of you that qualified to attend the Global Stars um, Summit in Abuja, we had a way forward for doing things. Part of the things we brag about in our business is our system. If you do not follow the system, if you do not use the system to work for you, trust me, you won't make money. You see yourself suffering and suffering and suffering. My goal today is to help you, guide you. I may not necessarily, I may not necessarily, I mean, tell you this is exactly how you must make your call. This is exactly how you must do this. No, just get the mindset. That's the main thing. And understand how to go about it. Do we understand? That's the main thing. Understand how to go about it. Do we understand? Okay. So, that is the, we've done this training before the system training but trust me you're going to listen to it today and feel like you did not even <laughs> you did not even listen to anything all right you've not heard it before all right um please hold on someone logged into my name and i'm going to remove the person because i've told leaders severally always log out so that you don't, you don't sign me out so i'm going to remove the person so that they can learn how to always log in with their own destiny all right okay so Moving forward, let me share this quote, okay? How many millionaires do you know who have become wealthy by investing in savings account? I want you to tell me how many millionaires you know that have become so wealthy by investing in savings account. I want, to have, I want you to tell me how many of you, even yourself, how many, how, how, how have you become wealthy by investing in savings account? If you have been in our business, if you have been in our team, I think it is insane by now that you have not learned that your money in savings account is not yielding anything. That your money is not yielding anything. This is the best time to invest your money. This is the best. I'm not saying you shouldn't leave some money in your savings account for rainy days and all that. But if you're putting money in your savings account, in, in your mind, you're, 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 you're investing or you're keeping money safe. That is the worst thing you can do to yourself. The 50K you left in your account, as of last year, sometime last year, that the value of your 50K was more than $100, was more, maybe up nearly, nearly $200. But now that your 50K is about, is, about, is about $100. So that's half the value. So guys, this is the best time. If you're running one account in our business, if you're running barely three accounts in our business, I'll advise you, start your journey towards increasing your accounts immediately. Start your journey immediately. And then follow the steps that I'm going to teach you today. Because the reason why I'm talking about these multiple accounts right now is, if you're running one account and you learn everything that I'm going to teach you today, it is a waste of money putting in all that effort into a single account, into three accounts, into seven accounts. Trust me. We are going to make much more money if you put in all that effort, all that effort, I mean, into seven accounts, into 15 accounts, I mean. Start your journey today. Some of you wake up much more in future after all your accounts have been scattered all over the you know, place to start saying, okay, now I want to increase it. Why don't you do it now? You don't know what your preferences will be in future. You don't know how much you would enjoy you know, being part of the business in future. Why don't you do it now? Why don't you? And then tomorrow you start regretting like some of the leaders. And we have told you people thousands and thousands of times that one of the major regrets some of the leaders have today is that their accounts are scattered. How can you make the same mistakes that some of us made? Not even some of me standing here before you. I made the mistake. Don't allow yourself to make that mistake. Imagine that I recruited two people that make over a million monthly and they are on one leg because of what? I had only three accounts at the beginning. 
don't make that mistake that I made. Imagine that I spread them across. I'd have been making much more money. Don't make the mistake that I made. Don't make that mistake. Okay? So um, anyway, moving forward, let's go to our various WhatsApp groups and say the meeting has started already because I don't see myself you know, doing this training again, except maybe system training 3.0. Uh -huh. Okay? So the year is about to come to an end. Trust me, guys. There's a lot we can achieve together. The year is coming to an end, but there's a lot we can achieve together. This is the best time to set the tone you want 2022 to have. Some of you want to wait for 2022 to start preparing for 2022. That is the worst thing you can do. By the time people, people will ease into 2022, you, you'll be struggling to enter 2022. All these trainings we're doing now, all these things we're doing now, cash in on it immediately. Learn all you can, you with your team. Check the participant list and be sure that all your teammates are in the meeting. If your teammates are not in the meeting, I want to see the cell meet, the, the WhatsApp groups right now buzzing with the, 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 the I know somebody asked me this morning for the link because the, the, um, uh, different leaders have their cell meeting links, okay? So go to the various WhatsApp groups right now and say the cell meeting has started and also post the link as well, okay? So moving forward, what is our mandate for the global? What is the mandate for the, the, the C21 FG? What is our goal, our 2024 vision? What is our vision, 2024? Let me know how many of us know the vision. Please, though, someone should help me post the same thing on the beginner's classes, except beginner's class one, because this training is, as much as it's important for new people, it's also very, very important for new, for, for new people. As much as it's important for old people, it's very, very important for new people, okay? So please go to, someone should go to the beginner's classes, um, two, three, four, and post the cell meeting link, and our people should start joining immediately, okay? What is our vision, 2024? I've not started seeing people posting it, though, so that our new members will learn today. What is our vision by 2024? To raise 50,000 monthly millionaires by 2024. What is the vision of the Global Stars team? What is our own vision for 2024? What is our goal in Global Stars? Global Stars, or not the C21 FG right now. Global Stars, what is our vision? to raise 5,000 monthly millionaires. Have you picked your goal? Yesterday, Ambassador Ronke trained on, no, sorry, not yesterday, on Monday, Ambassador Ronke trained on um, loyalty. And I bless her for that, you know, I, I, I thank God for that amazing training that she did on loyalty. We learned it at the leadership level. It was mind blowing. In fact, it had me even questioning myself and all that. There was something that stood out for me at that training. In fact, for me, that is the reason why people leave our business. You see, the re reason why people leave our business is because they do not understand that you're not loyal to me. No, you're not loyal to me. You are loyal to the vision. That is why when I see some people sweating to make money, yes, yeah, so we're here to make money, want to better our lives, better our families' lives and all that. But if you understand the vision of this business, you will not be struggling. It is people who do not understand the mandate that jump from one company to the other. After meeting us, after joining our team, you start jumping from one company to the other. You do not understand the vision. I am not loyal to Ambassador Ronke. I'm not loyal to Ambassador Mike. I am loyal to the vision which God has sold to them. Do we understand? And it is God who has placed them in that position. So I must be loyal to what they are seeing. So if you do not understand, you're not loyal to me. You are loyal to the vision. I'm loyal to the vision. I'm following the vision, I'm following the demands of the vision. If, if you do not understand this, that is why you keep playing and keep, keep struggling in the business. I said that, that training that day blew my mind. The reason I say you're not loyal to me is because anybody else can do what I'm doing. Any other person could have, if God wanted, wants you to succeed in this business, he will get someone else to get you to this business. He'll get another leader. I am not, I'm not all and all. If it's not me, you will not be in this business. No, no, I am not. I want people to understand that I'm just a, I'm just a dust. I'm just, I'm just a pencil. Same way, you must see yourself as very insignificant. 
The moment you buy into the vision and become a custodian for the vision, you become very significant. And of course, God will, God, of course, God will use you to make the vision. All the people who have become custodians for the vision, God will use them to make it come through. Our goal, I'm sure some of you saw it that day. Our goal is to help raise hard what? Financially free partners who will help raise other financially free partners. People who will use their monies for the collective goal of, uh, goal of this, uh, you know, this country. Imagine that a time comes when we've raised the 50,000 monthly millionaires and there's a problem in a part of Nigeria. And then we all say, you know what? Everybody bring one, one, one million. Do you know how much that is? I want you to go to the chat session right now and tell me how much that is. How much if all the 50,000 money millionaires, of course, if you decided that you'll be among them, if all of us come to the point in 2024, there's a problem in the country and we say, you know what, guys, let's bring one, one million at each. How much is one, one million at each from 50,000 people? How much is it? I want you to do the math immediately. Because if you do not understand what I'm saying today, everything, even the training I'm doing for you today is useless. If you don't understand the vision of this business. If you don't understand the end goal. If you're not working towards this end goal, you're wasting time. That's about five billion now. That's about, is it five billion? That'll be 50 billion. That's a lot of money, 50 billion now. That's a lot of money. Do you know how much problems we can solve? Government borrows billions of now. And we collectively as a team can bring such amount of money, guys. We can do this. You by yourself. Decide that you must become a monthly millionaire. You must be among those monthly millionaires. Decide you must. It's a must. We're not debating this. It's not an argument. Argument, I mean. You must become a monthly millionaire. The second one is what? Be among the millionaire creators. Because it's futile if you're a millionaire. You can't even boast of one or two millionaires you've raised. It's futile. It means you're a very selfish person. You want to just be eating your own money. You'll be checking. Have your people requested? Have they requested for code? For the leaders here listening to me, have they requested for code? You now approve. How many millionaires are you planning to raise? How many Amazon ambassadors? How many Fortune 500? If you're a selfish leader, you are not loyal to the vision. If you're a selfish leader, if for the past one year you've been a millionaire, you've not raised one millionaire, you're a selfish leader. You need to start raising other millionaires. If you've been an Amazon ambassador, for months and months and months, you can't boast of one Amazon ambassador. You too, you've even stopped being an Amazon ambassador. You've not raised one Amazon ambassador. That is, you're not loyal to vision. The goal is that you become an Amazon ambassador and start thinking, okay, who and who should I raise as an Amazon ambassador? You're not loyal to vision. Let's get back to our training, the, 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 the system training. They say risk comes from not knowing what you are doing. As far as I'm concerned, you know, the people think risk is really just investing your money in any investment. No. Risk is not understanding or not knowing what you're doing. There are some people that understand forex trading so much that is at their fingertips. In their minds, they're not even really taking risk so much because they understand the, the, the trends. They understand it so well. That is why they are so invested in it. That's why I laugh at people that call themselves forex traders, forex traders. They don't understand the science of it. It's not everybody. So it's risky to them because they do not understand. They do not know what they are doing. This business is not risky when you understand what you're doing at all. There's no arrow, not even risk. There's no arrow attached to our business. There's no risk in it if you understand what you're doing. If you're new in this business, you must understand and apply the system. Gain the proper understanding of our system today. It's important. Very, very important. Now, the system, let's talk about the system. Okay. I want to explain to you the sequence and show that your teammates are following the sequence as well. And show you are following the system, the, the system, the sequence, and ensure that your downlines are following it as well. Let me let me help you understand, let me help you understand the power of, 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 of ensuring that your team follows a proper system. The importance is so that you can build, eventually build a team that no longer needs you, but they are thriving. Look at what Ambassador Michael Okoli did. At the very beginning of the business, he was doing most of the work, you know, teaching his teammates, teaching us the system, bringing a lot of the system, the masterminds, you know, joined in as well. They were bringing the systems and all that. They put in a lot of work into putting the system together. And eventually, we bought the vision. We started doing the same things in our team. Small, 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 small. And then look at us right now. Look at most of the masterminds right now. 
They don't, most of them don't even know where they have um, states. They don't even know where they have, um, I mean, um, businesses. They don't even know. They don't know. And so Michael Cody came into my office the other time. I was asking him where my office is, where? And I was mentioning some places and he was shocked. Oh, is it, you have a TV, you're like, oh, wow, are you serious? And some of my, even me sometimes, I don't even know where I have teams. I don't even know where I have teams. People are just in different places. Do you understand? So if you have a system, people will just replicate it in different places and be thriving and be making money. So if you're not following the system, you can't teach the system. So today I'm not just coming here to come and talk and talk and talk and talk. This system is part of, the, one of the things we boast of in our business is the system. That's one of the things we boast of. You must understand and apply the system. So what is the sequence? The number one is what? Attend presentation. And of course, sign up. Immediately after follow up, I will explain these things one after the other. So you attend presentation, you make your, you sign up. And then most times people don't sign up immediately. And sometimes people sign up immediately. Rarely do people sign up immediately. For those that don't sign up immediately, how do they sign up through what? Follow up. Abby, they sign up through what? Follow up. I'll talk about follow up. I'll give you a crash course on follow up, especially for the young people in our team. Okay. The second one is you do your IPO immediately with your leader. If your leader has not done IPO for you, please call them. Even if you're an old member, you've been in business for five years. Call your leader now and say, please, you've not done IPO for me. If even my leader and I've not done IPO for you, call me, I'll do the IPO for you. Because the IPO is one of our core systems. It is very, very important that you do IPO. I'm going to share with you what IPO. No, no, no. Look at it in your welcome pack. Where you congratulate, you see it there in the welcome pack. For those of you that saw the welcome pack, the welcome pack is the beginner's class one. Download it. If you've not read it, download it and go through it. Anyway, there's no, re there's no way you'd have graduated from beginner's class one to two without um, reading the welcome pack. It's not possible, right? So in that welcome pack, what the IPO does is it sets the tone. It, set, it sets the tone for your relationship with your new intimate. It also removes any doubts that they might have. Because the truth is this, immediately someone sees the opportunity and makes their payment, you're no longer the only one talking to them. The doubts in their head are talking to them. The people that they will meet after will be talking to them. But imagine that you call them immediately. Congratulate them. Do IPO immediately for them. Let them, let them, let them in on expectations as well. Manage their expectations too. Do you know what that means? You would have, you would have been that voice of wisdom that will keep them in this business. So don't let any... Don't, don't, don't allow this system to depart from your team. If you stopped doing it in your team, get back to, the, get back to it. The thing about our business is done. People try to jump some things. Hey, let me jump it now and do other things. So oh, it's too stressful. The funny thing is you still struggle and come back again and start all over again to get it right. They say if you get it right the first time, once is enough. You don't need to do it two times. You don't need to do it three times. So you must do IPO. IPO is not supposed to be done by, let me give you an example. So um, let's say um, I'm new in the business. I register Jerry. I do Jerry's IPO. After I do Jerry's IPO, I'm telling him that, okay, so learn what I'm doing, you know, so that you can do the same thing for your downline. Do you understand that? So as soon as Jerry does um, um, his IPO and signs up somebody, it is Jerry who will do the IPO because the script for the IPO is already in the welcome pack. I don't know if I'm making sense. The script for the IPO is already in the welcome pack. It is that simple, all right? So the next one is what? Join the beginner's classes. After the IPO, they'll join the beginner's classes. While they wait for their, um, what's it called? Um, while they wait for their, their, um, their quick starter guide, right? So immediately after the quick starter guide, they join, immediately after, immediately after the beginner's classes, sorry for the mistake there, they attend their quick starter guide. The reason why I'm saying IPO is very important is because you may say, let me wait for quick starter guide. Quick starter guide in your office may take a longer time to happen. It may happen in, um, your quick starter guide in your office may happen in two days time, in three days time. The one on, on, on Zoom, you know, happens just three times a week. But IPO should be done immediately, all right? So after the beginner's classes, while they're in beginner's classes, they attend their quick starter guide, all right? After the quick starter guide, they drop their 50 name list immediately. If you're listening to me, you've not done this thing I'm saying now, please do it immediately. Drop your 50 names immediately. Nobody should come and beg you to do your 50 names. After sending the recommendation message, okay, I'll share with you an upgraded recommendation message. 
Then they graduate from the incubation after beginners classes. One, they attend the incubation graduation that happens every Saturday by 10 a.m. Very, very, very important. Very important, okay? So after they graduate, they complete their um, classes. That's the SM the standard method of operation. There's beginners class one, two, three, four, right? And when they complete everything, they are now added to the main group. But from beginners classes two, they should start attending cell meetings. They should start attending cell meetings. From beginners class two, three, four, they must start attending cell meetings. It's a must, okay? Attend all trainings, all cell meetings, very, very important. Engage in the DMO. What do I mean by DMO? The daily method of operation, I'll, like, I'll still show it here, okay? And then start building your team. There is no way you will go through this. All you need to do is just cycle it. Just go back to it and start doing it. Go back to it and start doing it. Start building your team immediately and then become a leader. Start learning. Of course, when you become a leader, what, what do I mean by becoming a leader? You start advancing in ranks. From becoming a Kingsman, from becoming a Kingsman to becoming a... A, um, um, a, an emerging leader, you start thinking of becoming Amazon ambassador, you start thinking of becoming um, Fortune 500 mil monthly millionaire and all that. Hope I'm making sense. Hope it's clear, okay? Now they say, that, now the system is the reason for our success. I've explained this already. Now why cell meeting? I'm going to quickly share the reason why cell meeting is so important. I know some of you may not understand. Now cell meetings are the bedrock of our business. You need to stay in knowledge and that is the power to overcome all challenges. Cell meeting is very, very important. It is the bedrock of our business. You must stay in knowledge. That is the only power you have to overcome all challenges because challenges will come. If you're not motivated, if you're not strong, you keep struggling and struggling and struggling. The reason why some of you are so powerful, you haven't quit the business since, no matter the challenges, the product, the this, the that, is because of what? You are always in power. You are always, you know, in, in building your knowledge, building your, your thickening your skin through the trainings. Anybody who misses cell meetings, their businesses are already dead on arrival, as far as I'm concerned. I don't try to waste my time with people who do not attend cell meetings because they will still come and ask me the things that I say in cell meetings and they will still not do it. I, I try not to waste my time with such people because what they'll do is that they waste my time and secondly, they'll still not do what I've told them. So of what use? The third one is what? It is selfish to want to end so much but you have no time to learn how it is built. It is selfish as far as I'm concerned. It's selfish. The person with a better strategy would always be the person that works the hardest as far as I'm concerned and cell meetings will always teach you the strategies. You see anybody making more money than the other person? Most times, not because that, that person is working harder. The person that is making more money is working harder. Most times, the person that is making more money has a better strategy. And that is what cell meetings will always teach you, the strategies, the strategies. Cell meetings gives you the power to build a sustainable organization. Most of the leaders you have, we have today in our teams, go and ask them what their, what their cell meetings look like. Go and ask them what their cell meetings look like. Sorry about that, I'm going to share this again, okay? Ask them what their cell meetings look like. It is not, it's not by, it's not just by, um, um, it's not by gra, gra We're not playing here, we're, we mean business. We're not playing here. We mean business, guys. We mean business, we're not joking at all, all right? So um, let me share this with you so that you also understand exactly what cell meeting means. If you're getting value, I want you to go to the chat session and say value. Are you getting value so far? If you're getting value so far, I want to go to the chat session and say value. As far as I'm concerned, this is what cell meeting is. They say personal development, this is from Brian Tracy, is your springboard to personal excellence. On, ongoing, continuous, non-stop personal development literally assures you that there is no limit to what you can accomplish. That is why we do not play with cell meetings. As far as I'm concerned, this is what cell meeting is. Personal development is your springboard to personal. Just replace that personal development with cell meeting. It's your springboard to personal excellence. Ongoing, continuous, non-stop personal development or cell meeting literally assures you that there's no limit to what you can accomplish in our business. Okay? So quick, I want to share with you this immediately. You can do a screenshot of it and start sharing it with your new teammates. Quick, effective message to send to your distributors within the three hours of registration before or after their IPO. Please, this message is very, very important. 
immediately someone registers in your team, you heard that someone registers in your team, do their IPO, immediately after the IPO, you send this message. If you're rushing to somewhere, maybe you cannot send the message immediately for whatever reason, quickly send them this SMS. And what is the SMS? Hi, Bimbo. It is a pleasure to have you in our team. Your success is important to us, but know that you have your role to play in it. Congratulations once again for making an important decision that will change the course of your financial future. I will send you the next step as discussed during the presentation. I will guide you through the gray areas. Cheers. Just send this message immediately to them. Are we getting value? Are we getting value? This is the message you must send to them immediately. I know some of you have been getting signups. You've been getting signups. What we do not realize is that what you do with a new signup at the beginning will tell how far they will go in the business. If you decide, you can still call them instead of sending it as a text message. But I'm, what, I, what I'm saying is you send it as a text message is that you can have it saved. So that anybody that signs up, you just copy, paste, copy, replace name, paste, copy, replace name, paste. You can say at the end, your leader, but you not add your name. Do you understand? It is very important. They say it is easier to recruit. I know they said it is really easier to recruit new blood, right? Than um, uh, resurrect old people. But as far as I'm concerned, yeah, that makes sense. So it makes sense. But as far as I'm concerned, it is stupid and foolish to keep wanting to recruit new people when I'm not saying recruiting new people is not bad because that's the life for, of your business. It's not, it's, but it's foolish to keep recruiting people and losing them. Recruiting people and losing them is foolish. It doesn't make logical sense at all. So it's foolish. What do you do to keep them so that you stop having attrition rates? What you do with them at the beginning is very important. What you do with them is very, very important, okay? So get the IPO script from the welcome pack. It is a call format for new teammates immediately after registration. Okay, immediately after re registration. So get the IPO script immediately. It is there in your welcome pack, like I said earlier, all right? So updated, this is the updated recommendation SMS. And I'll also send you the updated, um, let me open up my WhatsApp. Sorry, I thought I, I, put, I thought I put it here, but I just remembered now that I didn't. I didn't put it here. I'll try and post it. I'll try and post it, but you can be doing a screenshot of it. I'm trying to open up my WhatsApp so that I can, I can get it out for you guys. So Lani, I came across a concept that blew my mind. Those of you that haven't sent the SMS already, you know you're supposed to send your first recommendation SMS to 50, and then by your second week, you're supposed to send another 100 recommendation SMS. Very, very important, okay? So um, I came across a concept that blew my mind. I recommend you to the, I recommended you, sorry, not recommend you, please. If, if you did a screenshot, please do a screenshot again. I recommended it to La Buena Vida and the Good Life Project, run, running a business campaign now in Nigeria. They might contact you for their business partnership and also explain what they do. I hope they call you. It is as simple as this. Do not complicate it. It is not complicated. I'll talk about the mindset when people start calling you, the mindset to have. I'll talk about it. Don't be, don't worry. I'm going to explain all of that, okay? I'll talk about it. There's a new script for calls. That is what I want to quickly share with you guys. I don't know how clear it would be. I don't know how clear it would be, but I'll also post it immediately after this session, okay? So quickly, let me share it from my... Let me get it from my, my WhatsApp. Copy image, hold on. I don't know how much of it you would see. There's an upgraded invitation script for contact recommendation. Very powerful. Very, very powerful. So I don't know if you guys can see it. Can we see it? Is it clear from our screen? Guys, is it clear? I've never shared it before, so I'm sure most of you do not have it. Some of you might have it, but most of you may not have it. Good. Can we see it? Not clear. Not too clear. Mm. Someone said not clear at all. Someone said yes, it's clear. So that means it's not from my own angle now, it's from your, your angle. 
Just try, see what you do. Try and zoom from your own screen. I may not be able to, to zoom so much. Is it clear now? Let me know if it's clear now. Is it better? It's clear, awesome, awesome, good. Hello, good morning. Am I speaking to Bla? Now, please listen to how I will make this call, please listen to it. Listen to how I'll make this call, please listen. The part of the problem a lot of people have is that they are not making money because the person that is making their call is not making the calls very well. So I'm going to do like a dummy or a, 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 a I'm going to act like I'm making a call, okay? Hello, good morning. Am I speaking to Tunde? The person says, okay, whatever, whatever, whatever they say. I say, okay. Uh, my name is um, Ambassador Didi. I can say, I can, my name is Didi. I'm speaking to you from um, Century 21 Freedom Group International. You recommended to us by Peace. Do you know her? The person says, whatever the person says. You now ask, did, he, did she explain to you what the organization is all about? You must project your voice. You must sound like a professional. Don't you see how all these MTN callers, all these MTN customer care people, don't you see how they call? See how they call? It sounds so professional. You must sound like that. Don't bring your villageness to the, to the calls, please. Don't bring your village. Let me, you must not know that you came from village. You must not know, please. The person at the other end of the line must not know that there's a village in you, please. Sound as professional as possible. And this script is so simple, all right? Okay, we're a non-governmental organization that shows selected individuals a system to generate capital for their personal projects without interest rates and collateral. Currently, we're launching a, a uh, launching in Abuja. Are you in Abuja? If you're, in, uh, of course, Benue, you say, are you in Benue? We're launching in Benue, are you in Benue, blah, blah, blah. Just replace the script, okay? Okay, we're selecting credible and creative partners that will be part of the opportunity. And your name came to us highly recommended by Peace. So we'll be having a briefing with you and a few others recommended to us tomorrow by, now at this point, I like to say the first um, batch available, I say um, 2 p.m. The final batch available is next tomorrow by 2 p.m. Which of these sessions is more convenient for you so that I can confirm your booking process I mean, uh, confirm your booking and process your reservation in our system, okay? If you want someone to come at a specific time, give the person that one option. So let's say you're booking for Amazon, just give the person Amazon option, okay? So you now say, okay, you get the detailed address and reservation code through the reservation text I will send to you shortly. Please kindly know that you are to show this reservation code once you get to our office. This is, this is what we help this is what you would use to of course replace it with zoom if it's zoom you're inviting for you know where to replace with zoom okay please kindly know that you're to show this reservation once you get to our office or once you get in on zoom this is what would what we use to confirm that you are one of the people qualified for the opportunity if you don't get the text at the end of today feel free to contact and notify me with this number have a wonderful day if you want the person to come the same day, call them at least more than seven hours before the business opportunity starts. Do you understand that? that there's a way you make this call. That person will come that day. Please take your time and make the calls. You can also add before you end the call, please kindly know that if you cannot make this for whatever reason, let us know so we can cancel your reservation and give it to someone else. If you don't add this to your call, the person can think they can just wake up and cancel and nothing will happen. If you made these calls very well, out of your 15 name list, there is no reason why you should not have at least a minimum of 10 people that sign up in your business. Minimum, worst case scenario, five people. If you do the calls right, there is no reason why you should not make money. Okay, so points to note, sorry about this. The problem I'm having is I, I thought that I put this on, on slideshow. Sorry, not slideshow. I want you to note some points. Okay, the first one is, especially for those people sending the SMS, it is futile to go about the activities, you know, if you think that it will not work for you. The mindset is so important. I see a lot of people not making money in our business because their mindset about the business is wrong. You already think, ah, my friends will not join now. Oh, let me just send the SMS. If you already think the system won't work for you, the tools won't work for you, you think all these things won't work for you, you won't make money. You continue to struggle. Most of the people that you send the SMS to, they will not reply. They won't. Because the way you even send the SMS, some of them will even start calling you. Start, the way you will even talk. 
you start telling them mm, it's just one thing I, I don't even just the way you talk about it they will not register you will now waste the time the credit of the person that is making your call because you spot it at the point of sending the sms recommend 150 people the more the higher the chances of having a quality team 50 in the first one week and 100 in the next one week please this is what you must know the new people that are enjoying our team if you're an old member you haven't done this please do it remember what i say you skip the process you still get back to it always remember that you have absolutely nothing to fear this thing points i'm noting now is for the people that are sending the sms the recommendation sms this sms okay for those of you that just join our team and send this sms these are the points you must note you have nothing to fear you are in a genuine business and it is okay to have some people who will not be interested it's okay if some people say they are not interested do not think that those people are the are the determinant the determinants of your success the next one next one is when you receive calls you know after you send the sms a couple of them are going to start calling you let them know that you only stumbled on the knowledge and that you know that they will be that sorry you only stumbled on the knowledge and you know that they will be called for clarification if selected please not i selected if selected do you understand you know that they would you know if they are called they'll get more clarification remove yourself from the process let the person who's making your call explain to them what the project is about if you try to explain it to them they will ask you more questions more questions before you know it you start talking more than you're supposed to talk remember in this business the less you say the more results you get a wise person will check in on their investments. The problem some of you have, I want to help you get maximum results from your recommendation calls, your recommendation system, if you're using it, because that is the number one system we have here. When you drop the name list for your leader to call, it is your duty to ask for feedback. Your leader may be, your upline may be making so many calls. So it is your duty to ask for feedback. Okay, please, how far, how many people have you called? When are they supposed to attend? Check in on the prospects as well. I heard you've been called. Congratulations. Try not to be late. Very, very important. Don't just be sending these SMSs and then you leave your leader to do everything. That is why some of you are not making money because you don't check in on your investment. You don't check in on your business. It's like someone who pays for a, a store, puts in so many things, puts a salesperson and goes to sleep. You wake up and nothing, <laughs> nothing, no sale has been made. Have you left your business in the hands of someone else? And they, and they shocked you. You woke up and they shocked you. Also be part of the follow-up. Yes, your leader has some role to play in the follow-up, but you know it is your own business. It's your own business. Don't leave the follow-up process for just your leader. Unless your leader says, this particular person, don't worry, don't call this person, I'll handle this person. Do you understand? Be part of the follow-up process. The person that you've even invited would even enjoy hearing more from you than they would from the, the, your upline. Because it is you, they know, they've attended the presentation already. They have one or two questions. They want assurance. Mm -hmm. And it is only the person who knows them that can assure them. Use the follow-up script. Don't worry, I'll still share this follow-up script, okay? Points to note for effective use of the recommendation system for maximum result. Now, this is for the caller, the person who is making the call. Kindly note that you are a professional customer care agent. You must not be careless. You must not talk anyhow. You're not your duty, even if the prospect is being an annoying, it is not your job to respond to respond in annoyance as well. Take your time, be professional. Talk, talk like you want to be, you know, imagine the way you enjoy it when some MTN or all these um, um, service providers, the way they call you and talk to you, and you know how you enjoy it. That is the same way other people want to hear from you as well. I was talking to one of my interns. I told her that while I was working in the radio station, our when you're talking, our head of station would jump into the, 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 the room, the newsroom, and be asking you, what are you, why, why are you talking like that? Because nobody cares if you just did one bus buzz at home with your husband or your wife. Nobody cares. Nobody cares if somebody slapped you on the way to work. Nobody cares. What they want to hear is a fantastic voice at the other end, the person who's listening to the radio station. They want to hear one very nice, sweet, melodious voice. That is exciting. That is what they want to hear. Most of you, you tune into the radio, you know that sometimes when someone is talking, boring, 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 you remove it to move to the next one. Do you understand? So that is the same thing with our business. Someone is probably, you, the prospect you're calling is probably busy and you're calling them and wasting their time and talking, talking jargon. Take your time and make the call. Sound like a professional. 
as far as I'm concerned, quality beats quantity. Sometimes you want to beat your, your booking um, and target of 50 that you make the calls carelessly. Take your time, please. It is unfair to the person who has submitted their 50 name list. If you're not going to call it, then don't call it. If you're going to call it, then take your time. It's better to make a quality call than to make lots of calls and they are, they are very poorly made. If you sincerely want the pro progress of your new downline, the calls must be made effectively. Please forgive some of the mistakes I, I made. Please, I'm seeing some of the mistakes I made. I was typing so fast. And you must and the scripts, and you must make the calls with the script. The scripts are on your welcome pack. You don't need to start thinking, oh, where do I need to get the script? What do I need to do? The scripts are already made available in your welcome pack. Please make it a duty to train your call reps. Some of you, you recruit people, you get some um, call reps, you know, you, you, some secretaries and all that to help you with the calls. You don't monitor them, you don't train them. You must be training them every time. You must be training them. In the bank, they're always training their staff. In the um, um, MTN, I'm sure they're always training their call reps. Always, always train your call reps. Very, very important, okay? Let me talk about follow-up because I you know I mentioned part of your duty for the person who's sending recommendation message. You must do follow-up as well. So what can you do for follow-up? I'll give you a crash course on follow-up now, very fast, in, in two, three minutes. 90% of prospects need to be followed up on before they sign up. I know some of you, you send the recommendation SMS, lots of it, and then your upline calls. When nobody signs up, you start feeling bad. I'm telling you what you, the role you can play yourself to help get more results. Because that your upline that is making call, if they don't get results from you, they'll be getting results from other people. So you to save yourself. I'm trying to teach you how you can save yourself. Immediately the presentation is over, start following up immediately. For better results, you can even follow up before the meeting starts by letting the person know that they, they should try and stay through to the end of the session that they, they are going to be selecting people to partner with. Do you understand? If you don't follow up on time, you stand the risk of losing your prospect to someone else who does follow up. Every prospect has three potential uplines. It means that I had three op potential uplines. If I'm so wrong, you don't follow up on me, I'm that person would have followed up on me. So don't think because you are not following up that, 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 that someone else wouldn't. The fact that you're not following up on your prospect, that someone else will not follow up on them, don't think that. Don't even have that mentality. So let me give you a quick crash course, okay? So call the, the prospect immediately and say, wow, John, how are you doing? Amazing, right? The session was amazing, right? The person will obviously say yes because you've thrown a positive comment. Psychologically, they respond with positivity as well. Unless the person is totally a pessimist, but most times you get a positive response. Now, what do you love most about the presentation? Let the person talk and talk and talk and even share the objections, maybe. Let them know about the importance of starting immediately to enjoy the mastermind slot and enjoy the benefits. If they are ready to connect immediately, don't talk a lot. Some of you, someone sees the opportunity and they are talking, you're talking, 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 just be telling them, oh, why don't you sign up now? You know, just like my mentor, when she also, don't talk too much. Ask the key questions. Allow the person to talk. Ask the key questions. Oh, I guess you're ready to get started. You know, the importance, the mastermind metric is very important. What would have taken you, you know, two years to actualize? It can take you as little as six months. It can take you in your third month, in your first, you can even, recruit, you know, recoup your money in as little as two weeks. I would advise you to start immediately. When I saw the opportunity, I did not just take the mastermind mentorship, I grabbed it. If you did not take the mastermind mentorship, tell them that you did not grab the mastermind mentorship and you're strong. And then you know, you know how hard you had to work, but you, you're doing them a good, you know, you're doing them, you'll be doing them great disservice if you do not advise them well. So they should try and take it immediately. If they're ready to connect immediately, if they say, okay, no problem, don't start talking too much. Just give them the account number. How many accounts are you starting with? Okay, this is the account number to pay to. And then you forward the details to your leader for registrations. It's that simple. Don't complicate it. Don't talk too much. Some of you, the follow-up, during the follow-up, you start doing presentation. That's not what to do. Okay? If they have questions, immediately link them up to your leader to close them down for you, okay? Those that pay, forward their number to your leader for the quick starter guide group. You must do their IPO. Remember, you must do their IPO. Use the IPO script. Immediately they register. While they are waiting for their quick starter guide, you do their IPO. I've talked about the IPO already, okay? If they don't sign up, invite them for the quick starter guide for better understanding. You can also immediately, another thing you can do, let's say the quick starter guide is happening in two days time or happening the next day. Another thing you can do for them is that you can send them immediately, send them the videos 
of success stories, we have so many videos now. In fact, sometimes I want to place an ad, I don't even know what video to use. Sometimes I'm prospecting someone, I don't even know what video, because the videos are plenty. Is it the cars that they just launched right now? They are doing a video again that will soon come out. So the videos are plenty. Use these videos to close down your prospects. We also have the LBV question and answer document, document by Ambassador Nefo. I'm sure a lot of you have it. If you don't have it, get it from your leaders, okay? Over 70% of signups happen after events. So ensure that you always follow up. Invite them for the quick starter guide session, okay? Those that attend offline in a in, in please let quick starter guide. If someone attends presentation at um, let's say Cardinal office, let the person attend their quick starter guide in the office. Let them not join in on Zoom. Let only those who, who do not have offices around them build their business on Zoom, depending when they can set up their office around them. Do we understand that? Even in my office right now, there's cell meetings. So cell meetings, always have your cell meetings in your offices as well, okay? You know, I talked about the daily method of operation, the DMO for, um, I'm going to share DMO, okay? So let me quickly share what the DMO is, is like. So this is the regimented workflow for full-timers. If you're full-timers, you must put in at least eight hours every single day to build in your business. I'll talk about the part-timers, okay? 8 a.m. to 9 a.m. cell meeting, Okay, um, 9 a.m. to 10 a.m. reminder calls, very important. We have scripts for reminder calls in your welcome pack. That welcome pack is your, is your let, let it be your guide for this business. 10 a.m. to 11, p, 11 a.m., make all your follow-up calls. 11 a.m. to 1 p.m., book all your prospects, okay? Try and stick to 50 bookings every single day. Try, try, it may be difficult. Try, okay? Try, 1 p.m. to 2 p.m. break, 2 p.m. to 4 p.m. prospecting activities like questionnaires, interest form, all types of name lists. Ensure that you're prospecting every single day. As, just ensure that you're doing that every, every, every single day. Every single day, okay? 4 p.m. to 6 p.m. complete your booking calls and then 6 p.m. you can head out, okay? So very important. You must be prospecting every day, adding to your prospecting funnel, okay? All right? Okay, so workflow for part-timers, at least four hours every day. One hour is already into cell meeting. The remaining three hours, what you do with it is for follow-up, one hour for booking of your prospects, one hour for prospecting. I tell people it is not the number of hours that determines all the success, the number of hours you put in. It is what you do the, in those hours. It is not, a, you, know, I, you know, today I came to the office, I spent one, one I spent 10 hours, no. What are the activities you put in in those 10 hours? So this DMO is a guide. You can also have a weekly tracker like this that helps you to track your activities, okay? General bookings, how many people did you book? Generating third party list, how many people attended a presentation that day? Follow up calls, how many people do you follow up? How many calls did you generate that day? Have a tracker that helps you track your activities and, and then have a weekly summary, okay? Total bookings for the week, Total um, third party call list generated. How many third party call lists did you generate that week? Total attendance from you. Total um, follow up calls made. Total calls generated. And then let you can tell your leader, please, this is what I intend doing every day. Please hold me accountable every single week. The, you know, you know, you know the disadvantage that network marketing has. And I think it's, I think, I think, I think that it's probably part of the reason so many people are not making money in network marketing. That's where a lot of people struggle. Because there is no accountability system except the one we place by ourselves. In, in your workplace, there are accountability systems. If you don't do this, you don't do this, you don't do this, you don't get paid. But in network marketing, you can not do some things, do some things, and you may get away with some of them, even though you still struggle with it later, right? You by yourself, try and ensure that you, put, you place accountability systems for your business to thrive, otherwise you struggle. Let a leader be accountable to your leader. Please, this is what I intend doing. Please hold me accountable. By the end of the month, every week, I will always report to you. Very important. So this is just a guide for you. It's just a guide for you, okay? So um, the welcome pack goes through it. I don't need to talk about it again. I don't want to talk, talk about it. So please get your distributors to post their alerts. Once they, read, once they make some money, let them post their alerts. Share your alerts to prospect. And then, of course, on WhatsApp platforms, no matter how big or small, every single time, post, every time you encash, post it so that people see that it's working. If on all, all the um, WhatsApp all WhatsApp pages, people are just making money, but they are not talking. It doesn't make sense. But when there's product scarcity, people will come to the group and talk. When there's a challenge with company, people will come out and talk, forgetting that every other co company has challenges. But when the good things are happening, you're making money, you're not talking about it. You're not talking. 
You don't talk about it. But when the bad things happen, you'll be the first to talk about it. Are we assuring, assuring me on this chat set, on this platform right now, that we're going to start posting our lats when we make money? Are we assuring me? Are we assuring me that we'll start posting our alerts? Are we assuring me? Awesome, 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 awesome. Okay, so guys, let's do this, okay? So please, somebody just came into this meeting. Mimi, someone, Mimi, the person's code is 81ANAH. Um, Mimi, I'm going to unmute you. I want you to tell me who you are before I remove you from the meeting. Who are you, please, Mimi? Because that code, I do not know that code in my team. Who are you? Please unmute yourself and talk. Mimi, please unmute yourself and talk. Who are you in this meeting? If you don't unmute yourself, I'll remove you from the meeting. Please, who are you? Hello, good morning. Hi, good morning. Please, who are you in this meeting? I'm Mimi. I'm uh, under uh, Abigail. Um, uh, okay, okay, okay. The yes. co your code is not A-N, it's A-B. It's not A-N, okay. it's A -B. Awesome, okay. awesome. Please, leaders, help me also do this because I want to ensure that we don't have people from all, you know, other teams trying to intrude our, our meetings, okay? Otherwise, we're going to be struggling because this cell meeting, our cell meeting link is 500 and it's going to get there soon okay so we must call all distributors 24 hours after registration we must call distributors 24 hours after registration we must call them within 24 hours me i advise if you don't call now i advise immediately after presentation for maximum results but if you don't call your prospect 24 hours after presentation and it gets to my hearing or gets to your leader's hearing you must pay penalty of 5k see how important this is to me you must pay that penalty Every month, sorry, every month, not every month. Every month, we're going to be having our award day. The next award day is coming up pretty soon. Of course, first Monday of every new month, we award the achievers of the previous month. We're going to be celebrating Amazon ambassadors. We're going to be celebrating wealth connectors. We're going to be celebrating Fortune 500, Millionaire Club, Tukoma Club members, Prime Achievers, Millionaire um, Circle members, and then Club 2M and above, okay? So um, Ray is going to talk about how to qualify for these things tomorrow, even though it's in your welcome pack. He's going to break it down tomorrow. The person training is one of the leaders, the Global Stars leader, um, um, also, for, also a Fortune 500. Tomorrow he's going to be training on that, um, how to qualify. It's going to be part of the training he will do tomorrow. So for those of you that don't know how to qualify for different things, be there tomorrow, okay? We're going to be celebrating and it's going to be amazing, all right? Um, so great news. We're going to be having a combined retreat next year. A combined retreat next year. All the C21 MG top leaders are going to be gathering. About 5,000 to 6,000 of us in Abuja is going to be phenomenal. I'm not quite sure if it's going to happen in Abuja or if it's going to happen in Lagos, but wherever it's happening, it's going to be mind blowing. I don't know how many slots I will be getting because you know that C21 MG right now is massive. I don't know how many slots I'm going to be getting, but I advise you remain a top achiever in the team. That is the only way you can qualify. I will not give someone who, who does not even generate, has not generated code in months and leave, leave, I'll leave someone who generating code and give a slot to someone who does not generate codes at all. I won't do that. So ensure that you stay in power. All right. It's going to be the guardian of C21 FG leaders. The testimonies, will be, it's a two day, it's going to be a two day event. The testimony is going to be mind blowing guys. It will be mind blowing. You hear, ah, this step, you won't even, don't worry. All, all of us that are old in the business, you won't even hear our stories. All these new, new people springing up, all the new monthly millionaires, all the 5M achievers, you will hear things that day. You would, your eyes will tear. You will hear things that day, your eyes will tear. At least you'll see that, ah, this business is beyond me, it's beyond Ambassador Ronke, it's even beyond, beyond Ambassador Michael Okoli himself. You see lots and lots of people making lots of money. It's going to be mind blowing, okay? So remember the sponsors from get it from your welcome pack as well. We have it in the welcome pack. What, what you use to track your um, activities, okay? So um, those of you that are already have gotten to the level of maintaining your account, ensure that you do it before 15th of every month. That is the culture for our team. 15, before 15th of every month, you must do your maintenance, okay? Let me quickly run through the tools for duplication. Number one, beliefs cause you to action. Very important. As far as I'm concerned, the proof of belief is action. If you truly believe in this business, the only way you show that you believe in this business is through action. I've talked and talked about, see all the things I talked about today. The only way you would really show 
that you understood what we shared today is through action. The number two is what knowledge thinking. More results when a lot of people are thinking. You must be thinking, thinking, you must use your brain. You have more result when your whole being is focused on producing in this business. The number three is what? Activities. If there's a secret camera, watch it, watch it, especially the full-timers in my team. If there's a secret camera, to ask yourself, would the, a camera, would you want a leader to watch that camera showing your, your daily activities? Would you be proud to let your leader watch you? Would you be proud? Your leader is watching you on camera to see your daily activities every week. Would they be proud to see what you're doing? Industrialized connected economy. Yes, you're going to make a lot of money from this business, but you must start from, you must do the work in the beginning. It's not that you come in, you'll be, you'll be sleeping and expect to make money. You must do the work at the beginning. And then the work gets lesser and lesser over time. The second one is what? Imparting the knowledge. Please, that's imparting, okay? Imparting the knowledge. You must impart knowledge in your team. That is why you sell meetings. Ensure that your people are attending sell meetings. Ensure. Doing the activity. You must monitor the activities your teammates are doing. Document, document everything that's happening in your team. Document it. Very, very important. Okay? So we have big events happening this weekend. Zoom and off Zoom. Ensure that you're maximizing it. Your leaders have big events happening across. Ensure that you're maximizing them. Ensure that you're maximizing the amount as people are registering. Someone registers last week. They should start filling in, at, you know, doing the activities by this week. They should start inviting. Ask your leaders immediately for the activity so that you can leverage. I know we have a big event in, in Abuja this weekend. Ask your leaders to know if they are part of the big event in Abuja this weekend so that you too can leverage. It's going to be mind blowing. It's going to be amazing. And I'm going to be speaking as well. Invite massively. All right. So um, I'm going to be inviting someone quickly. Please, um, I don't know if she's in the house. Let me confirm. Okay, I'm seeing about three favors. Favor, are you in the house so that I can quickly make you a co-host? Favor, are you in the house? Favor, okay, now favor. The problem is I don't even know which favor. I'm seeing three favors here. Um, how do I know which one you are? Is that all you? All three favors, are they all you? Favor, are they all you? I'm seeing favor of Soaring Phoenix, but that, that should not be you. Please, favor, can you log out and log back in with, with um, favor or Sigwe? Please. So this is one of the Amazon ambassadors that qualified at the last Achievers um, event um, award day. It was, I, I had a little bit of a story from her leader. It was mind blowing for me. And I wanted to share her story today. Favor, please quickly log out and log back in, please. I'm going to give you five minutes to share your story quickly, okay? So guys, please don't log out. I wanted to be inspired by her story. She became an Amazon ambassador in a few months. And I wanted to share her success story with us and learn, let's learn from her, okay? Favor, your name is still showing favor in the log out and log back in with favor or segue. Your name is still showing favor. If you, if you come in with favor, there are three favors here. There are three favors here. So I don't even know which one to make co-host because I want to make you a co-host so that I can, you can uh, you know, share whatever I want to share. Rename yourself, please. Log out, log back in and rename. Guys, let's hold on, okay? She has five minutes to talk and I know we're going to learn a lot. She's going to, yeah, she's going to rename herself quickly. I know we're going to learn a lot from her, okay? So let's stay through. Hold on, hold on. Okay, is she on board now? So we heard from one of the Amazon ambassadors last, um, at the last event. We heard from one, just one Amazon ambassador. We didn't hear from the second Amazon ambassador. So we're going to be hearing from her today. We're going to be learning from her today, okay? So Favor, have you, have you logged in now? Okay, I guess she has. 
Okay, awesome. I'm making you a co-host now. You remember what I said, we're going to be doing this from time to time. Get people to share their stories. Get people to share their stories. I know how, I know a lot of you remember this award. She's the second person. Hello everyone. Hello. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning, my ambassador. Good morning. Thank you for giving me this great opportunity to share my story this morning. I'm Amazing. So, You're welcome. Yes, I'm so, so grateful for this opportunity. And once again, I want to take a thank uh, Julie that Jerry for also giving me this great opportunity this morning. So my name is Favor Osigwe Dabarichi. So my story this morning um, <laughs> is not really uh, it's not really a bad one, but um, I'll be sharing my little story. Thank you, thank you everyone, and I want to also thank our, our great leaders that um, um, make at their time morning. Sorry, and favor, we can't see you. We can't see you. Is your video on? No, ma, it's not on. Can you pardon me about Would that? I'd love to see you. Yes, maybe Would you. I'd love to see you. Times. Okay, Ma, give me, give me a moment. Let me go to a place where you can okay. see. Okay. Give me a moment. Thank okay, you. Please, we'd love, to, we'd love to see you. No, but nobody shares their story here on cell meeting and we don't see them. So it's important, very important. Okay, so while Favor is coming back up, um, Favor, I'll give you one minute to just adjust yourself. Let me just quickly say one or two things so that we don't waste time okay all right so um of course you guys are aware that we're running out december to remember this year uh, between um um first of november to 10th of december it's going to be um it's 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 running people are running running this already and like i said earlier even if you're not among the first qualifier second qualifier third qualifier and you recruit 20 in 40 days you still get a lot of things from you still get something from me okay and it's going to be still, you're going to still enjoy whatever I'm going to give you. All right. So everybody will win something. As far as you recruit 20 people in 40 days, you'll be awarded for recruiting 20 in 40 days. And also you'll get something from me. Okay. So I'm going to be live at the Unleashing, you know, the Woman Preneur Summit today. It's going to be amazing. I'm going to be the, I'm going to be one of the presenters today. So ensure that you invite massively. You can use Canva and create this. Favor, once you get back up, let me know. Once you're ready, just let me know. Okay. So um, use your Canva and create something like this. Post it on your various WhatsApp platforms. You can post it on your Facebook everywhere. For those of you that are interested, chat me up immediately. So post it alongside the flyer for the event as well, okay? I support the Unleashing the Woman Preneur Summit. Post it on all platforms. Do something like this. You can screenshot it. Use Canva. Download Canva from your... You can ask a leader to do it. I've taught a lot of leaders how to do it. Download Canva and then do the same thing. Promote it, promote it. Invite massively for the Woman Preneur Summit today. It's going to be amazing. This is the flyer for it, okay? So ensure that you invite massively for it. We also have the Muddy December Summit happening this weekend as well. Favor, are you ready? Yes, ma'am, I am. Okay, awesome. So you can share your screen now. Thank you, thank you, Mom. <laughs> thank you. My name is Favor, and um, I work with an oil and gas servicing company where I trade constantly trade my time with money. That is what I do. I'm right in the office. That is why I said let me take a few uh, minutes to go to where I can sit and talk and put on my video. So thank you very much, Mom. Thank you. So um, here in my office- Your I face, can you, can, you pull, can you move the, this thing a bit so that we can see your face well? We're just seeing half, your, half of your face. Sorry, sorry. Thank you. So I constantly trade my time with money. I work as a business development executive here. So um, I trade my time with money every morning, like 5 a.m. That is when I get to work before I stumbled upon this great opportunity. 
So to the point, I, I married and I have a kid, a five years old boy. Um, this, my child left the house like when he was um, two years plus. That is when I took him to my sister, just to go and stay with my sister so that I would concentrate on work and uh, little other things. So um, the point that struck me the most is when my child uh, uh, called, when I called them to speak with my child, my child called me auntie. Auntie, you don't come to our house anymore because it took a lot of time, like four months before I could, you know, uh, get to uh, visit my sister in Aja in Lagos. I stay in Lagos. So um, that was the one that struck me the most. Like it was just like a bomb in my face. I don't even know what to do. So that was when I started, although I've been looking for things to do other than uh, uh, the work, but I've not really found the one that interests me the most. Other ones, I, I sorry, I found little, but they are not really um, something you can confide in. Some of them have uh, eaten my money and all of that. But um, till this year, this year, March 7th, I stumbled upon this great opportunity online via Facebook where I was literally like, literally like going, you know, watching some feed when I had a little time and I saw Amazon women. So I now said, okay, this Amazon, I've, I've really seen it before. I said, okay, let me check what this is about. So I clicked on it. So when I clicked on it, I saw that, uh, you know, if you want to live life based on your terms, I say, yes, yes, this is what I want, you know? And the time, the, the, the time is, is the most important thing to, to me. Or, you know, um, so I clicked on and uh, joined a WhatsApp group where I was invited to uh, this great uh, opportunity where um, it was Ambassador Didi that was uh, also uh, speaking that day. So I joined in and I wasn't, I was still at work at that time because I worked from Sunday to Sunday. Let me show you, I work Sunday to Sunday. So, so busy, like from 5 a.m. to sometimes 12 a.m., 1 a.m. Yes, the, the least I've gotten home is like 10 p.m. Do you understand? So it's just like crazy. I couldn't even be it. I couldn't even, I don't even know what to do. I don't know how to start. So, but when I was listening to this uh, um, opportunity via Amazon, uh, sorry, on Amazon uh, via Zoom, I was like, uh, what uh, it came to me was when Ambassador Didi was taught. I didn't even hear what she was saying. What I had was, if I can do it, you can do it. I was like, and I looked at her, I was like, this beautiful lady that is saying that if she can do it, I can do it. I said, okay. So on the time of payment, I now said, okay, let me pay. That was when I paid with one account. I said, okay, let me see what this is about. Okay. So because even in the morning, when I wake up in the morning to go to work, I feel frustrated. I feel, I don't, I don't even, I feel disappointed with myself because I don't even have a solution to myself. So when I paid, I now said, okay, let me pay and see what this is about. You know, at that point, I don't really know what this is about, actually. So I now, you know, started, you know, checking. And mind you, I don't have time. I don't even have time to check what this is about. On the day of KOSG, that is the next day. I, it was on Sunday. On the day of KOSG, I was at work. So I even had to leave my office to my car to stay in the car to listen. But I wasn't even understanding what was uh, happening because I was constantly uh, being checked and called on my phone you know, to come back to work that we're having meetings and all that. So I couldn't even, you know, uh, check it and, and see what is happening. So what I did was to cut off. So I called my upline uh, leader, um, uh, Miss Josie. I, I told her that I couldn't, you know, listen to the um, um, QSG. So after what she said, I should not, I should not worry that she will explain. So later on, she explained. So on getting to uh, on getting to my three days, and I told that okay, I will um, I would like to do multiple accounts, you know, based on what she has uh, explained to me, which I did. I did seven, and then it took me like a little while to also complete it. So when my my business uh, really uh, took it on was when I don't even know what to do at that point. At some point in that business, like around a uh, um, April, May, beginning of May, I was frustrated still. I was like, I, I needed something to liberate me, not something to frustrate me. That was what I said. I even called Josie to tell Josie, I said, Josie, please, I entered this business for liberation. I did not enter this business to frustrate me still because I don't know what this business is about. So Josie said, okay, you're going to speak to, um, to G Leader Jerry. That was when I spoke to G Leader Jerry. 
that was when he took my he took me by the hand and that was when my business took a turn then he invited me to to global star uh, star summit where i i still do, don't know what the business is about let me be frank with you so it but at that summit was when i realized because I saw other people, I saw other people, other uh, 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 ladies uh, and, and gentlemen, you know, there, and I was, I, I felt among, because I just felt involved because I wasn't involved before. So that was when my business took turn in this uh, um, La Buena Vida. So um, I'll be sharing like the six things that has uh, helped me uh, so far um, to, uh, to this great, uh, um, um, word because it's a it's a new word that I'm living in. So um, this is this uh, the six things that has helped me so far. One of them is the mentorship. Two is the mindset. Three is the knowledge about our business. Four is the multiple accounts. Five is grow your business, and six is have faith in yourself. So I'll be uh, sharing about the mentorship. I'm talking about the importance right now. So mentorship is the best route you would take to become a more inspirational, more effective leader to your team. The reason I put this here is because um, when you, we are, we are being told that when we have one down line in our team that we're all already a leader. So if you don't have mentorship, if you're not attending cell meeting, you don't know what to tell your one down line. Just like the, this a great one that we have, we have attended this morning, this great one that, uh, this uh, a woman of courage has taught us this morning. So if you're not attending cell meeting, that means you don't know what you tell your downline. So what are you going to tell your downline? So it is important you attend cell meetings. It is important you attend the mentorship, which we are promised, and they are abiding by their words to give us the mentorship. So um, I don't miss mentor. I don't miss a cell meeting. I attend cell meeting every day in my office because after sorry after um. Before I attended a, a Global Star Summit, you understand, I came back. I, that was when I knew I had a very big potential in me. That was when I knew I'm living in a purpose. That, that was when I knew I could wake up in the morning and you know, know what I am living for. So I have time now. I have time in the morning. I don't go to work by 5 a.m. again. I can leave my house like 8, 9 or oh, it depend, depends, maybe if I have to leave early, that means I have something important, like a meeting to go to the office for. So mental, um, cell meeting has helped me with that. So um, men, uh, the second point is mentorship generates confidence, inspires trust, and fast track team development. So in this one now, I can't really stand and say, okay, and say, okay, let me speak to uh, so many people before, but that is what a cell meeting has helped me for, uh, with, sorry, that the uh, cell meeting has helped me with that one. So mentorship has the ability to inspire team through effective communication. Yes, if you have team, that means you'll be communicating with them and also teach them and you learn from them as well. So the, the, uh, the, the next point is mentorship creates an environment of intellectual stimulation. Yes, this one is a point for me. Then the, the next one is cell meeting. Cell meeting is very, very important, just like I've been talking ab about it uh, since I started this and uh, our uh, ambassador Gigi has been, uh, you know, sorry, the cell meeting this morning was about that. Cell meeting is vital, very, very vital, I must tell you. So that is where we learn the skills that is required for, for success in our business. So cell meeting is vital. If you're not attending cell meeting, just like she used to say, you will not last in the business. I think the most things that has helped me so far so far is the cell meeting because every morning I wake up, I know I have to attend cell meeting to gain little, uh, little more knowledge every day. So um, the last point there is that our leaders have broken the barriers in this business to give us mentorship and success. The reason I say this is that times I, I had that uh, there, were, there, uh, there was uh, times when uh, they don't have Zoom at all. So you have to go to the office. Someone like me wouldn't have gotten that opportunity to leave the work that is that has tied me so so much up, you know, to to go to the office to get cell meeting, but I can literally sit at the comfort of my office or at the comfort of my home to attend cell meeting. So um, the next point is uh, change your mindset. Success oriented mindset is a must have in the day if you want to succeed in this business. The reason I put this is. When I, I told you people that when I started this business, I don't know what it's about. I don't even have success oriented uh, 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 mindset, but I changed my mindset. I, 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 I was sleeping in fact, and I had to 
you know, saw it in, uh, sorry, and I had to, you know, dream about it and, you know, uh, I had to take it as a, a point of duty, you know, to do. Then when I changed my mindset, that was when my business kicked off. So um, the second point there is understanding your why. My why was to be with my family. That, that was my why. My, wife, my why was for my son to come back to the house and stay with me. That, that was my why. It was so strong that I couldn't even stay. When my child called me, auntie, I couldn't even stay. I couldn't even bear it because I cry about it every day. So understanding your why is about starting afresh and deciding on one goal or dream that when you achieve it, you will, it, it will mean a transformational change in your life. Identify something that could make a good impact in your life. That is when you find your why. I always tell my teammates, when you find your why or when you know about your why, the how is easy. How to do it is easy. Then the next point is once you identify, identify what your why is, write it down on a paper, sorry, on a note, on a notebook why it really matters to you. Not on a computer, not on, on a piece of paper, but write it on a notebook with your own handwriting. This is an important part of building your motivation. So in this case, when like my why is here, so it has been here and this I carry in my handbag every day. So every day I open it and see it. So it motivates me, you know, to go more, to do more, you understand. So changing your mindset doesn't happen by accident. It's happened by choice. Endeavor to take a leap today. So if your mindset is still down or you don't know what to do about your mindset, please change your mindset today. Sorry. So um, the next one is knowledge about our business. When you don't have knowledge about this business, uh, the business that you're doing, your perception about this business will be centered on bring one, bring two. No, that is not what we do. If you don't have knowledge about this business, somebody will this, is, this has been amazing so far. We're going to give you two to three more minutes, okay? This has been okay. amazing. So far, this is a full training. <laughs> amazing, amazing. Well done. Okay. Let, me, let me round off from here. So if you don't have the knowledge of the business that you're doing, that means uh, you don't, you've not started. And the next one is uh, multiple accounts. The reason I'm able to stand uh, in your presence this morning, you know, to be called Amazon ambassador is uh, on that, uh, on that uh, multiple account because he has helped me so far. On this multiple account, let me, tell, let me tell you a little bit of how I achieved it. I registered with one account. So I went to my, my, my boss after two days to tell her, please give me money so that uh, to pay me upfront. So she paid me, I paid for extra uh, seven. So I was sick for one, like one month. I wasn't able to go to the office. I came back to the, to the office after I've not even paid the one I collected before. I asked her to give me another money. She gave me, that was how I completed my 15. So, and let me tell you, the work you put in doing one account is still the same work you put in doing 15 accounts, trust me. And I don't even, I, I don't even, I, I don't even do too much. When you're doing 15 accounts, you don't do too much. But when you're doing one account or three accounts, you tend to struggle you know, to achieve that. Then uh, the second point is grow your business. This business, I will tell you this morning, is to, what I will tell you this morning about this business is to treat it like a traditional business. Yes. Treat it like a traditional business. A traditional business where you grow your business, where you grow your business, where you uh, package your business, where you sell your business, do it on this one. Grab every opportunity, every opportunity that we do, every activity that we do, grab it, every activity that we do, everything, every, uh, every uh, uh, plans, everything that we put in these activities, like the, the mode of uh, um, bringing in a prospect, please endeavor to you know, uh, do it so that you'll be able to achieve your goals. Then the last one is have faith in yourself and your business, just like Ambassador Didi said. If you're asked to send a, 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 a if you're asked to send a, a test message, you say, oh, I, I don't know if they are going to agree or if they are not going to agree. No, you don't, you, you're not permitted to do that. If you're asked to send a message, you send that message with hope that, yes, when you send it to that person, the person will uh, uh, respond uh, positively to you. Because when you don't have faith in yourself, you will not get a positive uh, uh, response to, your, to yourself. You'll be feeling down all the time. So you have to have faith in yourself, believe in yourself, believe in what you can do, believe in everything this business holds there to 
and also, be, sorry, believe in yourself and also the things that this business holds there too. Do you understand? So um, I will stop here now because my time has elapsed. So I'm going to be uh, sending a special thanks to um, Ambassador Didi because uh, she motivates me every day. She was the reason I joined this business. So I said, uh, despite that she doesn't know me personally, I said I will make her proud in this business. And I'm going to extend all my thanks again to Jilly Dajeri. He has been an inspiration. He has been a mentor. He has, he has been somebody who has been guiding me through the staircase of this business to achieve what I've achieved. And most importantly, I'm going to be thanking my teammates. You are all, you are all an amazing teammates. I'm going to be thanking you. And I will say, may God bless you. And may God bless the business that we're leveraging on to create success for ourselves. Thank you. Wow, 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 amazing. Once again, congratulations, Favor Osigwe, our latest Amazon ambassador. Guys, I want us to go to the chat session right now and say thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you so much for pouring out your heart and teaching us and making us learn from you this morning. That was amazing. In fact, that was a full training. I think she should she would need to share her training one day. Okay, it was it was amazing, guys. You know, you. Um, one of the reasons why I love. I love the fact that we started giving the platform for people who are achieving these feats to share their stories so that you guys will see that this business is beyond me. You know, this is something that is happening in our own Global Stars team. Imagine what is happening at the larger team, at the larger house, so that you see people who are like you, those of you that have jobs and you're giving excuses, see the one that she had. And I'm happy she mentioned her why. Some of you, your excuses are so much because your why is so little. So if the moment your why beats your, your excuses, you'll start making money here. You're so quick to grab your excuse. So many of you, your excuses, you love it so much. So you, you can't wait to grab your, your, your excuse. You can't wait to hold it. You can't wait to romance it. You can't wait to love up on it. Please kill your excuses. Kill your excuses. Your excuses, <laughs> like Jerry would say, you can either make money or make excuses, but you cannot make both. Okay, so we have big events happening this weekend, you know, leverage on all of them. Like I said earlier, I'll be at the Womenpreneur event today. Womenpreneur, I mean, event summit today. Ensure that you invite massively for it. And use this Canva to create something like this for yourself. It's very easy. Just download Canva, C-A-N-V-A on your app store. And then look out for templates. You can use this. You can use anyone, create it, and then ensure. Help leaders, help your teammates to create it. Those of you that know how to create, you can just ask on your WhatsApp platform. Those of you that want to create something like this, send to me. I will help you create it. You know, I've been doing it for a lot of you leaders. So do the same thing for your teammates, okay? So we also have it this weekend on Saturday. Invite massively. It will also be mind-blowing, okay? So I've shared this before. I've shared this um, um, before. Daily prospecting, there's one I shared with us to be prospecting on Facebook, on Instagram and all that. I shared that before. You can share with your teams again. You can also screenshot this one, all right, as well. Action steps, massive activity, daily prospecting, daily inviting, daily presentation, daily follow-up, push for growth in ranks, attend all trainings and expansion, ensure that you're doing these things every single day. We have now come to the end of the cell meeting, okay, guys? Let's go out and win. There's nothing holding us back except our mind, okay? Today's cell meeting, I hope you learned, learned something and I hope you got value. If you got value, I want to go to the chat session today and say, I got value, I got value, I got value. Well done, everybody. Have a fantastic week. God bless you, okay? I hope you learned something. Don't just learn and go to sleep. Learn immediately and do what? Start, sit with yourself immediately after the meeting. Sit with yourself, right? What are the things I learned today and what are the things I want to impart in my team today? What are the things I want to start correcting in my team? Because I'm sure today you also learned one or two things you would have to start correcting in your team. What are those things I need to start correcting in my team? Because I've seen lots and lots of leaders even at the GDA level self, so lots and lots of leaders that make, even at my own, even me self, there were some mistakes I made at the beginning and I now had to start correcting them much, much later. And trust me, it's the stress of correcting is, is crazy, all right? So well done, everybody. Have a blessed day. God bless you. Bye, everybody.